with Chief Meteorologist Keith Gibson. We've had some quiet weather recently, but tomorrow things will be changed up just a little bit. A chance for some gusty showers and storms and all this area and right across a good chunk of Mississippi and the Mid-South. A chance for at least an, an isolated strong or severe storm. Now, much like yesterday, we haven't really changed our thinking here. The overall severe weather threat is low from about mid-morning into the afternoon hours. Gusty wind, the main threat, the tornado threat, pretty low here. Not too concerned overall. We'll keep watching it as things evolve later tonight and tomorrow. Now, the system we're watching closely is out here in Oklahoma right now. Notice this arcing line of showers and thunderstorms. These have been wind and hail producers out there today. The system is just getting organized. We'll have some clouds fill in later tonight, maybe a few showers later tonight, but there will be a little band of storms that will get going in the wee hours of the overnight hours, and that will come our way tomorrow. Look at our great sunset, or this uh, the setting sun in the Columbus area this afternoon and the evening hours, some of those high cirrus clouds in the advance or out in advance of that system developing out there across the high plains. Now, for tomorrow, here's our plan, and we start out in the low 60s, becoming breezy later tonight and tomorrow. Let's just say windy tomorrow. Some gusts may be over 30 miles per hour. Our chance of storms from mid-morning into the afternoon hours, and then that system should scoot out of here by dinner time, it looks like. So tomorrow, highs will be warmer, lower 70s across a good chunk of northeast Mississippi and west Alabama. It's a little bit warmer than where we have been. Some of you started out in the upper 20s and low 30s this morning, so we'll quickly warm things up as we get into our day tomorrow with those southerly winds. At midnight tonight, clouds start to increase around here. We'll sh we should still be dry, but there will be a batch of storms developing out there in Arkansas. Showers and storms will be getting east of the Mississippi River sometime after sunrise, and then that band of showers and thunder showers around our area by midday. Now, some of this may or may not be strong, but there still could be some activity out there, some rain, some breezes here, and then some of those storms could linger into the afternoon hours. Now, it's not guaranteed we will see a lot of activity as far as strong storm um, tomorrow, strong storm activity tomorrow, but it's possible, so we'll just keep watching it. Rain chances here anywhere from about a quarter of an inch to maybe three quarters of an inch of rain. Now, there could be some more rain Friday, a bit of a break Saturday and then more rain, perhaps some storms on Sunday. So that's the way it's looking. We'll be watching out for those storms tomorrow. Pretty nice and Thanksgiving, mostly sunny 68. 68 Friday, some afternoon and evening showers that could impact high school football. Dry Saturday, more rain Sunday, much colder 40s early next week. It is Egg Bowl week coming up. Mike Leach, Lane.